we're live. We're live, I think. Excellent connection so far. Awesome, awesome. If for some reason the connection drops, I will pick back up on my something, my phone. Also, I have Cujo hair in and around my face because the boys are getting groomed today. Also, more importantly than anything else ever, if you don't know, this is my sister. Dun, da, da, da. I'm here. She's here. She's right here. She looks like this. <laughs> and <clears throat> we're super tight. I don't know if you can tell, but we're very close. Mm -hmm. All the way down to mannerisms and voices. For sure. Hey guys. I was literally just looking through all your old videos for something to watch. Well, we're here. We're here now. And she's about to move to Colorado because Air Force. And so we're going to make a piece that will be like Colorado-y for her walls. Mm -hmm. Oh, you have to meet Titan before we get on going with this. Oh, he's ghosted. He's settled away. Smooth ghosted. When we said we need oh. to introduce you guys, ghosted. He'll be back around. Ty Ty, what are you doing? Hey, you want to say hi before you leave now? You guys have the exact same voice. We hear that a lot. Now I'm mad about it. I'm just mixing the resin. Hey guys. Hey, hi, how are ya? This is Titan. This is Titan James, he's seven, and his birthday is December 18th. Now you have his whole bio. She loves her dogs, almost like someone else I know. That person's me. Heidi said you'll love Colorado. Afternoon, Miss Mary. Carrie Hicks lives there. She said she will help you if you need anything. We have a lot of fam in Colorado. Oh, awesome. Everyone says he's so adorable. And Jessica and her assist have the same voice as well. Mm -hmm. Lately, YouTube has been notifying me of your lives after the stream. Finally, I was notified correctly. I'm so glad. If you guys are subscribed, thanks. Um, and make sure that you're still subscribed and that the bell is rung because YouTube likes to unsub people all the time. So just double check. And if you're new, Subscribe, you know you want to. Hi Dar, how have you been? Greetings, salutations, one and all. We all love our friends. Super awesome. I concur. Alright you guys, let's get on with it. Cue the intro. I almost hit the wrong button. I need to put um looks like it'd be electrical. Of... Here we are. Freshness to do our work on. Okay, we got that from a movie. I don't remember which one off the top of my head. That would be Ace Ventura. Oh, yeah, that detective. Yep. Oh, and Francesca, thank you for reminding me. Y'all, leave me your thumbs. Please share the video. Because we're trying to grow our channel. And we can't do it without you. What up, Gin Germs? How you doing? Alright. We started mixing this a while back. And we keep getting distracted. So, I don't know how long I've been mixing it for. If you're new to resin, make sure you read the bottle and mix it for that amount of time. This bottle says three minutes, but it was a broken three minutes, so I don't know. You're learning how to wire wrap jewelry. That sounds exciting. What's up, JJ? Thanks for correcting that thing for me. I have no idea what happened, but your lip piece will be in the mail on Monday. Okay. I feel like it's mixed fully, so I'm going to mix for just another minute. It's so much better to overmix than undermix because it just won't set up if you undermix it. Does it make sense? All right. 
so it's Sunday at 2 o'clock and we're having a beverage because we can. Tink. God, that sounds amazing. Okay. Hi, hey, Sue. Our mom's name is Sue. It's true. We are having a great day. I hope you are as well. What's today? Sunday? Yep, Sunday, fun day. I mean, we're going to have fun no matter what we're doing, but it is a crappy, rainy, kind of chilly, crappy day. So, if you've been with us for a while, you know that Jessica's been here before, and we did a table for her, and so she has played with resin, doesn't usually do the resin, so... Essentially, since it's like two years in between each piece, minimal, <laughs> we're going to say this is teaching a new person how to do the thing. Mm -hmm. So she wants to do negative space. And the colors we're using are chestnut, white, Caribbean blue, which looks a little bit more green in real life. Yeah. Where are you? Oop. Where are you? <laughs> Think. Yeah, it looks more close to on this camera. Also this camera. It's like a Wizard of Ozzy green. A little bit darker. Yeah. And then Color Obsession Rich Gold. This stuff is amazing. Okay. So we're going to do Minimal Rich Gold. We're going to put that there. And we're going to do some base white as well. I'm going to go grab that. So Eric asked me to look at the pieces in her hallway, and she's like, tell me what you're going for. And I like the cells, and I like the mountainy one. Pretty much like all of them, so she's like, I don't, we'll see what we can do. Because I was like, I want no white space. Or no blank space, but blank space. So, we'll see. We're just going to have fun. <laughs> I want no blank space, but also everything tall. And also negative space. Yeah, negative space. Oh. I keep thinking I hear one of the pups behind me. Alright, we're also going to use Color Passion's Base Cell White. If you guys like big cells, you cannot lie, the base cell white is for you. Actually, any color, passion, okay, that's not going to, we'll just leave it like that. Any color, passion, paste will give you the larger cells, so... Use them if you want big cells. I have an idea for our project, so I'll be ordering abalone dust from you or whatever it's called. Yeah, abalone is amazing. Whitney, what's up? RK3. So, Rhonda and Whitney are in the house. You guys probably remember them from where I've been this week. They're super amazing, talented ladies. I would give you um, Whitney's YouTube channel. But she is slacking on getting it going, so you guys should tell her to get her stuff together and do a video, do a YouTube. She's talented, she's just, I don't know. I don't know, Whitney, what's the problem? Why haven't you posted a video and gotten your YouTube going? Rhonda's probably also been on her about starting the channel as well. What is up, Megan? Hey, Lisa. We're getting our toes done. Just rub it in. Rub it in. Sarah says, Whitney, get yourself together. Okay, well, now I'm going to have to get it going. You are. Lisa says she talks with her hands like you. I want to get my toes done. 
next time. Goals for the month. Well, while you're down there with Rhonda, maybe you guys can do the, like the inaugural video for your channel. So Erica, are you, did you put this and all those cups and then you're putting the same amount? Or are you just putting the color in the cups till it gets to the color you want? Are you trying to tell me I've gotten off top topic? No, I just don't want to miss a creative step. Y'all, she's the most organized person on the planet. And you guys already know that I'm not that. So, we're going to do one tonight. She's scared. Of course she is, but you got this. Um, so, you put the amount of resin in your cup that you want represented for each color on your piece. So, I know that for the gold, I don't want that much. So, I just have a little bit of resin in that cup. And then we're going to put the color in there. And then this is good for two hours? Yes. But since it's such a big quantity of resin in the bucket, mm -hmm. that could be super reduced just because... I'm going to have to put a little bit more pigment in here. That could be super reduced just because... When there's a lot it'll get hotter quicker and then that'll make it start to cure up faster so essentially you want to get everything out of the big buckets and out onto a surface to keep it cool and that'll help to extend working time exactly Sarah no mistakes only happy accidents just do an ocean you already know that your bomb at oceans Okay, y'all, this gold is one of my new favesies. <laughs> Thought I was gonna have to get your gains to help me open that for a second, Jess. <laughs> this stuff is like molten gold. We um, went down to Rhonda's pro class, I just said a second ago, and this was one of everyone's favorite colors. Because it's like molten, literally like liquid gold. It's not going to focus because of... Oh. Oh. Can you put my hand behind it? Oh, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> like if I put it all the way up in there, it's still not going to focus. Anyways, it's awesome. I'm going to pour it everywhere. Dar said, good question, sister. Excellent answer, Erica. Y'all are so supportive. Uh, Rhonda and I also discovered while we were teaching with this color that it's kind of a cell activator. What's that mean? It just means that it helps to promote cell creation. Oh. And the cells are those little circles that you like. No worries, Dar. Right back at you, Rhonda. is amazing. Okay, next we're going to mix our low res. And I know this process of mixing colorants just takes a long time, but I feel like it's important for people that may not have used resin before to see the full process and what it entails. Because mm -hmm. I get a lot of comments like, oh my god, can you just jump to the art part? And that's great and all, but what about the beginners, you know? Like me. Um, it is a little bit darker than Montana. Montana is more of a bright gold, and this is a rich gold. What's up, Lone Star? How you doing? You're good. You got a message from Tudor. And Tudor's on his way. And Tudor's on his way. Um, this color palette, by the way, is one of Rhonda's favorites. She does chocolates and coppers and golds and aquas and teals and turquoises all the time because they're amazing colors together.
Also, Rondo Tudor is on his way, and I know he's going to want to give you an air hug. But I understand if you guys are, like, super busy. Missing you and Bowie and Cujo. Well, we miss you guys, too. Thanks for having Crawfish Night without me. That was super fun. I'm sure. Absolutely. Everyone has to start somewhere, and the basics are so important. They really are. Also, if you guys are into countertopping, you have to check out Rhonda's videos. She is also Stone Coat certified and is an absolute brilliant artist and teacher and countertopper. Um, why the two different whites? So one of the whites is a top cell white and one of them is a base cell white. I'm going to use the base cell white on the outside to give the bigger cells and then on the inside where I don't really want that, I'll use the other white. Um, I need a list of colors that you sell for the beach waves thingy. So I can just tell you, I use titanium white from just resin, or you can use Angel White from Lorez, or you can use Color Obsession Snow White. And then I use Bondi Blue and Turquoise Seas and Blue Lagoon Tint from Color Obsession, and that's it. And we all forget steps and could use a reminder. Well, for me, that's the case. Absolutely. There's nothing wrong with a good reminder. All right, Jessica, first step is we're gonna pour this clear resin over this white background. And okay. this is so that we can grease the pan. Grease in the pan? Yep. Do you put hands. my hands on it? Yeah, you can put your hands on it. Mm. So gooey and sticky. You're just trying to cover up all of the raw area so that everything has resin on it. Okay. Also, if it's acting like it's a little bit thin, you can add more. We don't want to put more than an eighth inch of resin down because everything past that is probably going to run off. When you blow dry it, or the heat, heat gun it? Heat gun it? Heat gun it? Kind of, yeah. But also just because it's just going to try to self-level. Oh, I think it's trying to self-level. Probably is. Rhonda calls this lubing your substrate. Well, she used to. Sounds scientific. Definitely sounds scientific. But then I kind of, I said something to her about it. I was like, you're going to lube it up, huh? <laughs> and she was like, okay. So we're not going to use that word anymore. That's bananas. You're going to use all the terms? <laughs> terms you've used a long time ago when I've used them? I say that's bananas still. It's still topical? Okay. Jerry Walker, I'm confused. I'm picking up some of the resin because it's a little bit thick in some areas. But ultimately, I think we're good to go. I think I put a rag behind you on that stoop, that chair. Do you want me to wipe it on it? You can, you can just like. Or in the cup. Oh, yeah, you can do that. Okay. I don't want to waste it. Waste not, want not. That's me, scientist. Science, Rhonda. Okay, so we got this out. And you can see there's some like bubbles mm -hmm. and things like that. That's fine. I'm just kidding. I don't know where all of my rubbing alcohol is, but you wipe it up. Jessica and London. London's so fun. I haven't been, but I've seen a lot of documentaries. And I want to go to London. One day. One day we'll do a class in the UK. Alright, Jess. <laughs> lube it up, sister. Got to. Try to control the lube. Okay. 
So next thing, we're just going to hit some heat to pop these little bubbles. And then I'm going to do the first color down just to show you and then it's going to be all you. To do more. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I'm going to do the first color and then you're going to do all subsequent colors. Okay. Right. Right okay. And lay down behind me. I'll go back. Okay. That would be the best pouring with you in London. Find me a venue. We'll make plans. Okay, so I call this like a Pepsi because we're just going to do kind of like a, a Pepsi swoosh. Not sponsored. Not sponsored, but if you're watching, what's up? So you're going to start the pour off the piece and then go all the way off. Okay. And you don't want to pour all of it out. Like I still have some left. And you want to do it just about that then. So just go all the way down. Let's do the chocolate next. This one? Yeah, it's chestnut, sorry. Do I go above it or under it? Um, just go right through the middle of it. The middle? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sorry, it's out of focus. It'll come back into focus when we put other color down. Yeah, Megan, she did. Nice. So, now do the turquoise one. Do I have to start it before I start it? If you want to. We we just mixed it, so it should be fine, but it's so pretty. Never hurts. Do you try and, like, layer it exactly on top? Or if I have squigglies? But it's art next to it. Okay. Eric and I are kind of opposite, because I'm like, what are the rules? But there isn't any. Because it's art. Right. She's like, what are the rules so that I can follow them? And I'm like, what are the rules so that I can bend them just a little bit? <laughs> it's like that. Perfect. Because you still wanted to see the colors, or when you blow, when you keep down it, are you going to... I'm so excited. I'm like, what's going to happen? What's the end of the story? We're going to write our own stories, what's going to happen. Mm -hmm. So I'm doing just a thin line of this gold because it'll take over. If I just let it set there, it would take over. Never mind doing things. So I'm just going to heat it one more again. I hope I didn't get those whites mixed up and put the base on top and the top on base. That would be awkward. I'm just gonna grab some swipey papers. Okay. Every time I go down to Rhonda's class, she surprises me with, hey, can you teach this? And one of the surprises, like, can you teach this, is a swipe. It's arguably one of the more difficult things to teach people not because it's a hard technique, but just because people are so nervous about it, intimidated by it. But I believe in you, so okay, let's do this. Hi, nice, Mom. Hey, y'all. I'll swipe it. Swipe it. Doves. Um, the gold that I'm using is actually on my website, artisttilldeath.com. If you search rich gold on my website, it'll pull up. So, here's the rules. Okay. Ready? Focus. Don't do like this, because you'll just scrape it off. You want to do horizontal. You're going to lay it down, and whatever color you lay it in is what color your cells are going to be. So if I lay it in the gold, that's what color your cells are going to be. If I lay it in the aqua, that's what color, so on and so forth. Try not to get it all laid in the white because your piece is white. And that may not look the most amazing. How far do you swipe it? Until you're done. Like until it goes where you want it to. So I'm going to take my time. 
pulling slow because you want it to pick up and redistribute the color as you go. And then I'm going to turn it sideways and trail it off with a point. That is really soft for some reason. I'm going to put some more of this color in. So that hopefully on our next pull, it'll be more opaque and like a deeper color. So I'm going to do just one more because um, to make sure that the colors are where we want them to be. There are no rules. Do what you love. It's true, Rhonda. It's true. Okay. I like to put it the paper in multiple colors so that we get like an ombre. And the slower you go, the better it will look. Once I go fast, it starts to thin out. You can already see these cells popping up. Ooh, there. It's not going to focus, but you can tell that they're there. We'll do a true color video as well. Okay. Do you think that you got this? Mm -hmm. This is for you. Hold it that way. Yeah. Okay, pull it this way. So you're going to pull it just along the same that we just did. Now I'm going to shut a little bit of this curtain because it's blowing out my camera. Okay. Going in. We believe. Horizontal. Russell says, I can't get the swipe down for the life of me. If you need to two-hand it, don't feel bad. I almost always two-hand it. Agreed, Lisa. Jessica says, I did a piece with swiping recently. Tested my patience for sure, but the cells are worth it. Jump in with both feet. That's how we learn. Agreed. No worries, Melissa. Thanks for tuning in. Looks awesome. Looks awesome. Make sure to, so that was good. Let's pull it off so that we don't drip color out there. So the only thing is that you didn't trail it down to a corner. So it's kind of a blunt stop, but since it fades out, it's okay anyways. So are you ready again? Mm -hmm. Can I like overlap them? Yeah. Okay. So this one has a corner that's pointing down and a corner that's pointing up. You just want to pick one and make sure they're both pointing up because if you do it like this, it's just going to do like two claw scratches. Okay. Also, when you use two hands, it's easier to like trail it down to one side. I'm going to just rotate it slightly just to make it easier. So I'm going to put a little bit more color right here because it's just a whole bunch of the white word. So I can overlap it? Sure. Or should I not? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> Dropped it. I'm going to go with it. Just go with it. Commit. Still pull slow. Holly says these colors are my jam. <laughs> I touched it right there. My okay. It's not clear. So. Uh -huh. I know you got a little cute tail there, but it still essentially looks like a blunt stop in comparison. If you like it like that, roll with it. A lot of times it all comes down to preference. These are looking so fun. Mm -hmm. Let me just give you guys another. Look at those awesome plastic cells we got going on. It looks like hair. So it I like it. Does look like hair. So I'm just gonna show you the trail look. 
this one more time. So now I'm going to pick up where my right hand one is. And the last thing that's going to come up is the corner from the left. Okay. So you're just doing this. And that way you can get that softness. I like, I like this action going on here. Yeah, that looks good. Make it do. I'm going to get another bit of swiping paper. Okay. I'm just going to make sure all the corners are face up and or one's not down, one's not up. Oh my goodness. What if I called you one day and was like, hey, can you guest spot for my channel? I can't make it today. Will you just do the feed for me? Yeah, just send me a kit. I will send you a kit. Okay. I'm just going to make sure that... Well, I guess when you're in Colorado, you'll have the internet. I don't want to cover up your cells. Okay, so is it the more I go, the more angly I get it? Yeah. You're going to try to... I feel like I'm in surgery. Scalpel. But you said don't put it in the white. Right. So let's put a little bit more color down. So you can avoid putting it down in the white. Erica, you're the best swipey swiper there is. If there was an Olympics for swiping, we'd have a gold. I accept the swiper award. On behalf of all swipers before and after me, so here we go. Cheers. Bringing up the right. Squiggly, squiggly, squiggly. <laughs> that looks good, but you did this. Uh -huh. So you actually brought up the left. Uh -huh. But still looks good. I thought you were supposed to bring up the left. Bring up the right. Squiggly, squiggly, squiggly. Oh, I see. Okay. Got it. We got more swipey paper. Pull a Marcy and blow with a straw. I don't even think I have a straw here. So bring it up the right. Let's see. Okay. Let me know if I'm just messing this up. I would never let you mess it up. Also, you can't mess it up. Dar says your other right. <laughs> What's up, Johnny? Okay. Don't want to mess it up. You can't mess it up. Just because I remember you. You. I saw you touching it. Yeah, take your time. Okay. Now this side's gonna come up. You cannot mess it up. This is art. Concur. It's looking good. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, I drank all mine. Cheers. That's what sisters are for. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do this last little bit because sometimes these ends are difficult. You make it look so easy. Yeah, but you have to consider that I do this every day. Every day? <laughs> I'm about to say that. Every day? Every day. I'm also going to re-swipe just one little bit because everything's all squiggly and this is kind of a straight edge. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to... So you can over squiggly? You can do whatever you want because this is art. Mm, that's cool. I love this, uh, these browns and these golds together. You know, this is around this jam color combination. It reminds me of hair. Love it. Mm -hmm. So we always pull towards us because if you try to do this, your boob's going to get into resin, first of all. Mm -hmm. Second of all, if you forget to just drop the paper, 
and you try to bring the paper back, you're probably going to dribble color into your negative space. No and we don't want to do dribble. that. No one likes the dribble in your negative space. Also, we, whoops, I'm just going to call that a choice. I just accidentally scraped that right there, so that's fun. Um, I was going to say something very important, I'm sure, but I forgot what it was. You talked about boob in, your, in the resin. Yeah, but beyond that. Hi, Johnny. Thanks, Art. Yeah, my other right. <laughs> so stressful. Is it though? All right, so this time we're gonna pull this way so that we have kind of that feather. Look. Lynn! Lynn's up in the house? Lynn's here. Where? Oh. Y'all that um, other beautiful person over there with my other sister, our other sister. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so this is an inside joke. Rhonda says, this could be a finish all on its own, but, because she does that, she does something awesome, but it's just like the base coloring of it. She's like, this could be a finish all on its own, but, we're gonna take it one step further. And then it gets awesomer and awesomer. Oh. Tudor! What's up? What up? Hey, Lynn, good to see you in the house. How was your workout, Sesh? Didn't go. Didn't go? Did you hear me honking outside? I did hear a honking in the other two. What colors were you using? Chestnut, Caribbean Sea, Rich Gold, and White. You're making a leaf? Yes. Hey, I'm scared. Give me scared. Well, it is a swipe shoes a cup that time, exactly. My other sister said, I'm just going to call that a choice. It's probably Erica's life motto. No truer words have ever been spoken. Every accident that works out, I'm just like, I'm just going to call that a choice. Anyway, so you're not going to the gym? Nope. Can't gym in the rain, I guess. Last time I went to a gym in the rain, some houses were missing. Some houses were missing? <laughs> so are you dragging from up here? Or are you I, dragging from right here? I would pull from, like, I would caddy corner it right into these colors right here. Okay. Nami. Mm -hmm. Nami. Yeah. Pray for me. <laughs> I'm trying to do it. Okay. I felt like you got so I was driving a stretch. Like Eric was, was doing this, but then she was, like, pushing down one of the corners. I'm like, how do you push That's down a corner? Time. And do it at the same time. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Here, this is Titan. Go and slow. Go and slow. Go and slow. So this time we're gonna do like you tried to do last time, and you're gonna pick up this hand and trail this hand. Tell me when. Go for it. Start to trail. <gasps> Don't be nervous. You're getting better. They it looks great better. in silver. I like it. Yeah. It'll get even more of that. So, you have to pick up your roommate at five? Uh, he's delayed because of the, the weather. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. <laughs> oh, Rona said, hey, Tudor, in all caps. Do you have all the panels on? I do have all the panels on. What's up, everyone? There's a hair in that one, so we're going to really swipe that. Okay, it's a 10. Oh, yeah. You got your weightlifting in for the day. Girls, how about some fire glass between the swipes on either side, like the middle line of a feather? 
could see that happening. Looks like a ponytail, Jessica. Saving some of my things from work for like four by six. The shipping labels? You can always use scrappy paper. Um, also, if you guys hear a bunch of stuff in the background, the boys are getting groomed today. Make sure you follow the flow of this. Don't come too far out towards you. That way. Quite an extensive haul. <laughs> Take care of the way. That's good. I forget it's not my fault. Gosh. Jessica, um, She fell asleep. I left the window open. And she woke up to someone outside yelling about, I know you got my phone. <laughs> and like in her uh, asleepness at 3 a.m., she was like, I don't have your phone. <laughs> yeah, the window was open, so it sounded like they were in the room. He was like, where'd my phone go? And I'm like, <laughs> where the hell is my phone? Sir. Where the hell is my phone? Have you heard that song? Mm -mm, no. I'll play it for you guys after. Like, Y'all are killing it. Erica, did you tell Jessica about the mermaid habitat? I didn't. I haven't told anybody about it. So Rhonda's husband, Kenny, a.k.a. RK3I Candy, wants to build a lazy river around their property. And I was like, so, should definitely just call it a mermaid habitat and get some, like, ag tax write-off. And then I can come habitat in your mermaid habitat. <laughs> Anyways, it's a go. They're going to build a lazy river. I mean, mermaid enclosure slash habitat. So right now I'm just trying to fix it. Ooh, that is not cute. Cool. <laughs> An accident. A choice. A choice. What I'm gonna do is just oh, so remove that. Cheat code. This is a cheat code. Hashtag resin cheat code. When we were on our second tour in Australia, I showed that to some of my students. And they were like, oh, you can't do that. And I was like, yes, you can. Don't ever let anyone tell you otherwise. <coughs> but Jessica, feel how warm this is. Just feel the bucket. Feel the Ooh. Because we left it in like a big quantity. Mm -hmm. But if you like hold this, it's not as hot. Mm -mm. But some reason. So that's the science happening? That's science happening. Alright, so um, don't want this to set up on us. I just remembered that I'm not using stone coat. I'm using just resin. Because I need to order more stone coat. So this one actually only has a 45 minute working time. You have like all of the cells in this piece. And let me just tell you, there are people that message me literally every day asking how to get cells. And you did it. So it's from that, that white that promotes cell growth? The white and the rich gold both promote cell growth. Or AKA are a cell activator. You can tell Titan's um, comfortable because I can step over him and he doesn't even look at that. He's just like, <laughs> He's like I'm get out. there however you get there, lady. Yep. I'm taking a break. Don't even worry about what I'm doing. Kind of looks 
like a fish. It kind of looks like a ponytail. Kind of looks like some weird fire. Looks really cool. Looks like all the things, but more importantly, it looks like a piece that you and I did together mm -hmm. with Colorado -y colors. So I'm gonna run some of this gold through the feather. Because feathers have a spine. However, if you don't like it, I can swipe that through the rest of it. I do like it. <gasps> so pretty. These cells are just bananas. Sounds like all cells. Very cool. I will do a true color video for you guys. Ooh, that may be my favorite. Mm -hmm. I like the gray one because somehow colors you don't choose they get you get colors you didn't know was gonna be. yeah for sure well I tell that to people when they're picking their colors I'm like you have to consider the secondary color that's going to happen mm -hmm. when those two colors mix which will 100% happen nothing to do about it so, when people are like, I want to do a, an orange and blue, and I'm like, you are going to commit to these colors? Because when orange and blue mix, they're going to make, like, duck poop green, mm -hmm. which is no one's favorite color. I don't care who you are. So, I'm going to do a true color video real quick. TCV. Love the colors on the swipe design. Hi girls, what's up Tammy? Thank you JJ. And I just wanna say on public record, and for the record, that's public, that's live. Congratulations to Erica and Jeffrey for their engagement. <gasps> I didn't tell anybody. Well, it's out there now. I'm Erica, just kidding. You told everyone, like, it's a running joke because yeah. I post about it like every other 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. Does this make me look married? <laughs> yeah. Or engaged. Engaged. It makes you look both, Tudor. Yeah. yeah. It's just a cell explosion. It's beautiful. It's gonna look great on your wall in Colorado. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Love it. Love it. Make this the cover for you. Go. This is perfect. Is this considered a four? Or is that no, that's a four. Um, the gold that we used is called a rich gold shimmer. You gonna focus? Yes. It's by Color Obsession. I think I have ten in stock right now. So, if this is a color that you want in your life, chop chop. I'm going to take this to the dust free zone. Jessica, if you have anything to say to the people. Oh. You just want to be like, hey, hi, I'm someone. So, hi, people. Oh, this also, Jessica has a YouTube about things. Oh. Yeah. So, like Eric mentioned, yeah. I also have a YouTube channel called Jessica Typed In, but it's not related to art. It's about frugal living, fitness motivation, and minimalism. So, just throwing it out there. But uh, I just got back from deployment and I wanted to spend some time with Erica. So, I'm in Dallas for a few days. So, spend time with Jeff and Erica. And then I got home, and then in a month ish, I'll be moving to Colorado Springs. Military life. And I'm learning how to juggle. Also, she can juggle. TCB to TikTok and Insta. Yeah, I'll put it on um, Insta, TikTok, and ATD's poor people. Thanks, Carrie. It's getting brighter outside. Mm -hmm. So. We don't have gloves on still. It's all right. I just need to wipe these off. That little rag right there. Okay. Yeah. Jessica, great job. I've seen your channel. Absolutely great. Thanks. 
It's fun. It's like a creative outlet. I started it when COVID happened, and I had a lot more free time on my hands for a little bit. So I was like, I need to get this information out there because people, I won't get into the spiel, but it was just fun to get the information I knew out there. That's right. She's wicked smart. Uh, Tudor commented, thanks for your service, even though he could have yelled it from the other side of the room. Thanks for your support. <laughs> oh. I usually don't waste my resin, but this was setting up, which is one of the great things about stone coat resin, but I mixed up this one instead. So you guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something. I hope you were either entertained, educated, or inspired in some way. You know. Usually I take Pujo out right after so he knows what the bye-bye sounds like. Mm -hmm. So he's sitting over there like, do it, do it. I wish I start saying the bye. Mm -hmm. Anyways, um, please share some of our videos if you get a chance because we're trying to grow our channel. We can't do it without you guys. All the colors you can find um, with their name down in the description box. And you can find them to purchase on my website, artistfulbed.com. Come here. Oh, my channel is called Jessica Titan. Aww. I know. Alright, you guys. Check us out at nope, all of these places. Okay. Oh. Are you done with that? Are you done with that? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I can't find it in the shop. I wanted those color session goals. Okay. Give me two seconds. I'm going to post a link to it specifically. You're beautiful. I know it. I know it. Okay. 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 Oh, that color's so pretty. Oh, we just used it. Okay, you guys. Here you go. It's in the... Nope. Alright, it is in the chat, and also I'm going to go ahead and add it in the description box. There we go. Alright, all of the links. Y'all are amazing. We'll see you guys tomorrow, Monday, at a regular time, 6 p.m. Central, Standard United States of America, Milky Way University. And yeah, have an awesome day. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Let's say I said bye. I said bye. So, mm, so. Bear, 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 bear.